guys, it's Sharika and welcome back to my channel. Before we get into today's video, I would like to thank You Nice Hair for sponsoring this video. So this is a glueless, kinky straight lace front human wig. It's 24 inches long. It's Swiss lace. It's 13 inches from ear to ear, and then it has a four inch parting. It comes with the elastic neck, three combs, and the adjustable straps. Okay, y'all. I just finished flat ironing the hair. It looks very, very natural, very pretty. I love the way that this turned out. Here is the parting. I could have like flattened this part a little bit more, but I love it. I love the way that this turned out. It feels very natural very natural really pretty i just literally finished flat ironing it so i have on like my little shirt that i like to do my hair in but it is gorgeous so pretty this looks really good like oh my gosh so nice it is really thick y'all already know how kinky straight hair is it's just like our hair. So really nice, soft, really pretty. I had to do a few passes uh, with the flat iron to get it straight. Um, but hey, we're used to that, right? <laughs> so I love this. This is really cute. Look at this very natural i like it a lot so i'll have all the information along with the discount code in the description box below good morning y'all i just came from the gym but i came home to switch cars because i have some stuff i need to take back to amazon i had ordered these glasses they're way too small they look real cute on the girl but they were way too small so I'm taking them back I'm not gonna show y'all cuz they look full okay no and then I'm taking back the um, robe that I showed y'all with the feathers this one here I bought it because I was gonna do a cuter Christmas intro but I decided to do something simple so that's really the only reason why I bought this robe and because I didn't really like the sleeves, it just threw me off. I just wanted the sleeves to be longer. So I've had it in my car, in this car for a while and I've been wanting to take it back. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this back. Um, I do wanna go look for a blazer today because I wanna wear that little outfit on date night. So. Um, it is 10 16 the mall doesn't open until 11 so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, take this stuff back we're in my garage and um, so it's a little dark and I don't have my light on my camera I brought my camera this time Get everything situated okay I don't know. Oh, here it is. I was about to say, I don't know where my hand sanitizer is. <clears throat> Y'all, so I had a really good workout. Um, on Wednesday, I've, I've started um, taking Wednesdays off from the gym so I can pick up a day and work out with uh, my husband. Because y'all know during the day he's at work and then when he gets off, that's when he usually goes to the gym. So on the weekend, sometimes we'll work out together. He showed me this new little move that I can do to work on my abs. Last week when I did it, I hurt my back. I didn't tell y'all about that. 
but the machine on one side was the weights was heavier and I didn't realize I had did that so on one side of my lower back I think I had pulled the muscle well I guess I didn't pull the muscle because I guess you'll know if you pull the muscle I hurt the right side of my lower back last week so I wasn't able to do that move let me get out of this garage okay let me get out of here but I did it today I'll insert a clip right here it's really cool And I was in H&M. So y'all know I was looking for a blazer, an oversized blazer for date night. Um, so I'm trying on the blazers, minding my own good business. And girl, this lady, she talk about, it's too big, mama. And I'm looking at her like, <laughs> like I was thrown completely off. What if I was dealing with something? concerning my weight like I'm losing too much weight or something and you come up behind me it's too big mama and it was the way she said it and I'm just looking like girl what uh uh it was no I said that's the look I'm going for excuse you I know I'm looking crazy right now and maybe it looks like I need a, a few dressing tips but sweetie Girl, please. <laughs> well, I tried on a few different um, blazers. So I went ahead and bought two just to see which one I like uh, with the leggings. And I mean, you could wear the leggings with anything. You could wear it with an oversized sweater too. So um, I plan on wearing it more ways than one because I really like those leggings, but I do want to do the blazer look. I'll tell y'all when I get home because I want to try to order a salad from Maziato's, Maggiato's. Um, the other day when me and my little sister went for lunch, they have this chopped salad. It's delicious, okay? It's so good. The only thing, it was a lot of dressing. And me, I don't like my salads to be drowned in dressing. It comes made up already for you with the dressing and everything so um but it's really really good so i'm gonna get i'm gonna stop up there and get one to go without the bacon it does come with bacon too so um if y'all like bacon but i'm gonna tell them no bacon i might get like a um oh i got a chicken at the house but i really need to do like no meat anyway so let me do that. Let me order that and then I'll talk to y'all when I get home. Okay, hey, y'all, I'm just in Maggiano's picking up my salad. And I got my medicine ball from Starbucks. Okay, y'all, I made it home. I got my, I got my medicine ball. And I got my chopped salad from Maggiano's and I did like a side of salmon. I know it doesn't look like much, but I'm telling y'all, it's so good. It's the dressing that they put on it. It's really good. And when you order it in the restaurant, um, the dressing comes on it already. And it also comes with bacon, but I didn't want bacon on mine. So, um, yeah, this is my lunch for today. I've never had their salmon before. So, yeah. The salmon looks good. So, this is what I'm having for lunch. So, I'm going to go ahead and eat this and then relax for a bit because I feel a little beat up today. <laughs> good morning. Today is Friday. I have on my little rose 
colored a mess. I think I either got these from, did I get these from Target? No, I think I got these from Amazon. I either got these from TJ Maxx or Amazon. Maybe Amazon though. So yeah, I'm just in the mood to pamper myself. I might do like a little facial because y'all know I'm trying to get over this cold. Well, I feel a lot better today. I know yesterday y'all noticed I was very stuffy. So um, today I feel a lot better. Um, so I'm getting ready to fix myself some tea here in a bit. And I put these eye masks on, but now I kind of feel like I want to do a facial. Hold on, let me go in my bathroom real quick so I can show y'all this little stuff that I bought that I want to try that I still haven't tried yet. I need to clean up. <clears throat> okay, we're walking. Let me grab it. Grab this and then we're out. <laughs> How y'all doing? Shoot. Hope y'all having a good day. Okay. So, I think y'all were with me when I bought this. The Ordinary Peeling Solution is the AHA 30% plus BHA 2%. It's a peeling solution. 10 minute exfoliating facial. I've been wanting to try it. I think it come out red. Let me open it. Hold on. Let's sit y'all right here. And I'm getting ready to fix myself some breakfast too. I, Y'all, these green pajamas, they're so ugly. But I like the, <laughs> I like the black Santa on them. But this green... I can't get with it. I wish it was like red or white. But um yeah, I bought this that day I went to Target and saw that they had an Ulta in Target. And then I bought this. I love these little eye masks. I need to use up a lot of that stuff that I have. Like y'all know I, I have a bunch of face masks. Lip mask. I really need to use the lip mask. I never use my lip mask. And I said I was going to start using that stuff up. So I've been trying to like do this stuff every day. But. Well not every day but. See look. It's red. It's like blood. Look. It's like blood. <laughs> yes girl. So I want to try this. It's like blood. So you're supposed to clean your face and wait for the skin to dry. Do not use on wet skin. Um, you apply evenly across the face, neck, using fingertips. Avoid the eye area. Leave on for no more than 10 minutes. Rinse thoroughly with lukewarm water. Do not use on sensitive peeling or can promise skin. So. I'll try this later on tonight. Not right now. Because I'm just not in the mood. But I'll do it. Maybe after I finish eating breakfast. I'm going to do a acai bowl this morning. After I drink my tea. Well, I took it out the freezer. So hopefully I'm in the mood for it. Because y'all know I'm not a big breakfast person. But I've had those little bowls in there for a while. And I don't want them to go bad. So I need to eat them. I have three in there that I need to go ahead and just eat up. So I'll take y'all in the kitchen with me to do that. Let me show y'all what I got from H&M. Hold on real quick. I'm gonna put these blazers on a hanger so y'all can see them. Okay, so here is the first one. Is this the one that I was trying on? She told me it was too big. It's not it. All right, so this is the first one. I'm gonna try it on, but y'all probably can't get into the full look, so I got this, my pajamas on still. This one 
it's just long. It's not so much oversized. This one still fits, but it's really long. Cause the arms and stuff, you know, it still fits on me. So um, I just really like this one. And I like the length on it. So I don't know, I might still keep this one. It's really cute. You know what I'm saying? And I could wear like some, um, let me back up some. I could wear like some, some black shorts with this and the, um, kind of like the no bra look. Of course I'll use um, some of the boot tape. Y'all know that look, that'll look really cute. So I might keep this one. You know, have my hair, pull it back in a bun. I think that'll look cute. Something like what, um, what I had on when we went to that um, wine tasting downtown. A look like that but the shorts would be a little fitted so I think that would look cute this is the one she was saying was too big now y'all have to try to look past the pajamas okay because you know we want it to be big so this is how it looks and then there's two buttons on it and I would probably wear like a cute little um, bralette under it. Uh-oh, the buttons came loose. I would wear like a cute bralette under it and then the tights. So, and I would probably have to just button it up like about right here. So, yeah. I think this one looks really good. And it's long enough it covers my butt. And it covers the front. I probably still have to just pin it like down at the bottom. But I think that this will work. So, and that is the second one. Let me get my finger. Yeah, and it's crazy because I don't think I've ever purchased a black blazer from the store. I think I always get them thrifted. But this time I just, I didn't want to go in the thrift store because the one that I like to go in, not the one that I went to to get the jackets, but it's this other thrift store that I like to go in. It's very organized. It doesn't have that thrift store smell because I really, I have a hard time in thrift stores just because of the smell. And it's this one, that I used to love going to. It was so nice and neat, clean. It smelled good in there, but they closed it down, so. And then I bought these pants right here. This is how they look. Let me see. Can y'all see that? It's not really coming up on camera how they really look. But they're wide leg. They look real cute that I can wear for the season, the Christmas season. So when we do little stuff, I like to be festive. Hopefully we'll have something where we can dress up a little bit. But these are really cute. They look real cute on. I got them in a size medium. And I was um, thinking the next thing that we do, um, I could wear these. So yeah, grab those. And I just got two pairs of sweats. But remember I was telling y'all I wanted to do the oversized sweats and I totally forgot about that. And so I just bought these in my normal size. They have the ones in there now that has the black um, tie right here instead of it being white. I think the ones that I have, the other ones that I have that says original right here, I think this part right here is white and I hate that. I actually took that out. So, I have these. I got them in a size large. They fit really cute, but I did want to get something that was oversized. So, I'm trying to debate on whether I want to 
um, exchange these or not. But if I take the blazer back, then I'll go ahead and exchange these for an extra large. So I got them in black and white. <clears throat> and then they had these socks. They had like different ones, the two pack. I like these right here. These are so cute. And then they have the ones that had the uh, glitter hearts on them. So yeah, grab that stuff. So I'm, I'm gonna keep these in the bag just in case I decide to exchange them for a bigger size. So it's still hot outside. But yeah, show y'all the blazers again. Y'all tell me what y'all think. Should I keep this one? This is this. I wouldn't wear this one with the tights. I mean, I could, but y'all know that I'm going for that certain look. But should I keep this one or should I take this one back? Because I was thinking about just wearing these with, um, like I said, some shorts and have my hair pulled back. I already got like a little look for this. Both of them were $49.99 for both. So, y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments. Alright, so now I'm getting ready to in the kitchen and fix myself some tea and oh remember I was telling y'all um about sisters so before on uh, BET plus they only had season four on there but now they've unlocked I think season two season season one season Two, I think three is still locked because you'll know y'all know it'll say like um you need to pay for it so should I go back like is it worth going back I do want to start from the beginning but I really like that show they unlocked a couple more episodes because I was on season four so they unlocked I think like episode 17 and episode 18 I think they unlocked three episodes I forgot they was doing that kind of stuff. Like, they're not going to let you binge watch everything. But I thought that was just on Netflix. Because I know Netflix is definitely doing that. They're not letting you binge watch certain things all the way through. I guess if it's new, um, they'll lock it down. And then you have to wait until they load it. Which is so whack. Like, who do y'all think y'all are? Let me go in here. I'm going to fix myself some tea. And... Uh, chill for the rest of the day so yeah I put my unit back on I'm gonna take y'all in here and show y'all what kind of tea I'm gonna have because I know y'all want to see it but after that then I'm gonna go ahead and end the video here because I am going to be in the house all day today so let's go in the kitchen and I'll show y'all the tea Okay, so I'm going to have some of this Echinacea Plus tea. And then I'm going to do a chamomile, vanilla, and manuka honey. I do mix my tea bags. So, and this one is with spearmint. So, because usually I'll pop maybe like a peppermint tea in here or a mint tea in here. But this one is spearmint. So, yeah, that's what I'm going to have for my tea. Oh, and really quick, these are the acai bowls that I have in there. So I have three left. I got these from Sprouts. So I'm just letting it get soft. And then I'll just add like some more fruit, um, chia seeds, coconut, bananas. Um, I'll probably do raspberries because I think that's what I have. And that'll be my breakfast for the morning.
right y'all so i'm gonna go ahead and have my tea edit this vlog that you guys are watching right now so i'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here i hope you guys enjoyed it don't forget to like share and subscribe follow me on instagram at i am sharika b and tiktok sharika b too and i'll see you guys on the next one i'll holla